To secure the digital mixer valve, first mark the fixing holes in the required positions. Then drill the holes and secure the unit with the fixing screws provided. It's recommended at this stage that the hot and cold supply pipe work is flushed through to remove any potential debris. Then, using the push fit isolators, connect the hot and cold water supplies and the outlet connectors to the digital mixer valve. To connect the coupler cable, first remove the anti-tamper plate and the rubber grommet from the digital mixing valve. Fit the rubber grommet over the cable, then connect the coupler cable to the valve, inserting the rubber grommet into the socket to provide a watertight connection. Reinstall the anti-tamper plate to secure the grommet and coupler cable in place. The electrical connection should be a 3 amp switched fuse spur. To install the bath fill assembly, first push a gasket onto the filler head and a gasket on the filler body and screw them together either side of the bath so that the bath filler head outlets are facing down. Next, assemble the drain head and drain body with gaskets in between. Fit the flexible pipe in position with suitable clips. The flexible overflow pipe connects the filler body to the drain body. Connect the drain body to your waste outlet and the water supply to your bath filler. Having completed the finished wall surface, use the template provided with a spirit level to mark and drill the user interface fixing points. Drill a 30mm hole to house the user interface connections. Take care so as not to damage the user interface cable concealed in the wall. Next, fix the back plate to the wall with the wall plugs and screws provided. Having located the user interface cable from the conduit in the wall, connect the cable on the back of the user interface to the cable from the valve, concealing the supply cable in the cavity of the wall. Push the interface into the back plate, top first, making sure to press the button on the bottom to click the user interface into place. Having done so, the final connection can be made at the mixing valve by connecting the user interface cable to the coupler cable. Making sure that it's on a flat even surface, mark the center position where you want to install the on off button with an obvious vertical line. Taking care so as not to damage the user interface cable within the wall cavity, Drill a 30mm hole through the finished wall surface. Then retrieve the digital valve cable from the wall cavity. Next, using the cleaning wipe supplied, clean the surface around the mounting hole leaving the marked vertical line. Remove the adhesive back from the button, then connect the cable to the on-off button pushing the rubber grommet into place to prevent potential water ingress. Visually align the on symbol to the line on the wall using the vertical line applied earlier. Having done so, the final connection can be made at the mixing valve by connecting the user interface cable to the coupler cable. Remember to download the Myra Mode app to fully configure your product. Now your Myra Mode bath fill is ready to use.